and it's efficient and efficacy is proven. no downtime it's non invasive and so the people it's only the price i think <laughs> okay we'll come on that book, we'll come on that. to book dozens and dozens absolutely but yeah it's absolutely. lovely it's meant for all thank you so much thank you. my next question is to dr jeshu what's the kind of profile that comes to you at your clinic who would like to take cool sculpting is it only the celebrities is it only the models no certainly not as i said you know uh, some time back that it's something uh, for anybody who has been exercising and has been eating well eating right doing all the right things and yet has those stubborn pockets of fat so if um, somebody who's 90 years a uh, 90 kilos a weight and come you know that person comes and says doc you know i want to do cool scalp i'm sorry it's not for you you know maybe you should go to my husband he's a bariatric surgeon <laughs> but <laughs> so you both again compliment each other <laughs> yes yes but uh, yeah and and i'll tell you that it's not just a female uh, orientation that yeah. thing uh i do have 60% females yes who come for cool sculpting but 40% are also males and they are happier clients because they come back for more cycles because they have the pain capacity the pain deep capacity. pockets so you know um you they finish with their abdomen then they say okay we'll come back for more cycles for our flanks we'll come back for our thighs so it works that way so guys yes they are also there yeah but then it's very important to sort of counsel them because it's not something where in you've you know done your cool sculpt and you're you know it's all hunky dory you've got your double chin off I'll and then you go up. and yeah and then you're going and hogging away to glory and you're not going to prashant and you're just sitting back <laughs> doesn't work that way excellent uh my next question is to shweta shweta tell us how's the response been for cool sculpting in india yeah with uh, increasing income range and uh, with people becoming more and more conscious uh, about looking good and people like prashant doing a good job and making people aware of how to look fit uh something like this like fat reduction has become uh, is uh, something very important in the plan of uh, they're looking good and hence we see a good response and especially as people said that when something which is proven scientifically proven and when it is effective when it delivers result as what it is promised and when it is safe people and when it is when which has got something which has got very less downtime people generally look for those solutions and hence it is a welcome approach i In feel India. with all people who want to look uh, uh, toned and sculpted actually so fair no mirror okay where do you see cool sculpting 3 years from now in india yeah so if all you look at sculpted on everyone's tummies <laughs> 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 absolutely i was about to just say that. i would say if it can play an important role as part of a comprehensive plan in looking good whether it is a fitness regime diet regime and all that and if people if somebody is looking at a comprehensive plan and if it can play an integral part and important role i'll be very happy so in every indian who is looking for a comprehensive plan of cool sculpting is part of it i think i have achieved something good excellent so basically not health and cosmetics more of a lifestyle it's a, it's a way that you live and the choices you make Absolutely. Uh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. That would be cool to have it like that. Thank you so much and I would like to now hear from Mark in the last as to what plans does he have for India going forward? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so th thank you again uh, Monica and thank you everybody for the very inspiring words that you're uh, speaking out around uh, cool sculpting. I think there are a few things important what I pick up from uh, the conversation here. I mean we're all privileged people that uh, live longer in the future you know by 2050 you know the average age will be 100 years wow. now that will be i mean we're grateful that this all happens but together with that there comes a responsibility we physically also will need to be adapted to that longer life and be in perfect shape so in that sense uh, you know we are a company that is really leading in medical aesthetics and you know lifestyle is part of it but it will become an integral part of the way how we compose and the way how we guide ourselves through longer life that we can be feel first of all proud feel confident and you know 
if you're lucky, beautiful as well. <laughs> you know, so, so that becomes a lifestyle that we have to cherish and that we need to help uh, building. Our responsibility as a biopharma company is, first of all, providing you innovative tools and products. But secondly, train healthcare professionals around the world and everybody that touches these products in the best possible way that you as patients and consumers can really have the best outcome. And we take that really very serious. And thirdly, we will need to bring awareness to the public that it is okay to look good. It is okay to do procedures that you feel better and you realize your potential. You're becoming really the best of yourself. That is really okay. So with that, uh, Monica, I, uh, I, I really thank you again for moderating the session. I, I'm very excited. I've been here almost a week. I'm very excited with what I'm seeing, with the spirit that I'm feeling in India. I'm very excited that with the help of our professionals here, that uh, we're going to help many consumers and many people living a better, healthy, and, and really a fulfilling life. Thank you very much. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Let's give it a big round of applause to this panel. Thank you. Who's going to take and make us more healthy? I'll invite Shridhar over to stage. Post the photo op, I would request all the media to kindly come forward to put your mics on the table for a media bite. Start okay. Yeah. Please let us know whom you're asking the question to, so we can uh, accordingly get the punishment. Hi, Hi, Hi. 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 Hi.
यू नो उसमें मैजिक क्या है एज इज जस्ट अ नंबर में मैजिक ये होती है कि अगर वो नंबर बोल दो तो देन इट बिकम्स अ नंबर जो लोग डरते हैं बोलते हुए उनके लिए वो एज थोड़ा भारी हो जाता है सो दैट्स वाई कीप से जो आपकी तरह ब्यूटिफुल एक्टर बनना चाहते हैं मिस यूनिवर्स बनना चाहते हैं उनके लिए क्या टिप्स देना चाहेंगे आप Sculpt your personality, sculpt your body, cool sculpting. You know, you should write this down, man. This is a nice sure, byline. Sure, sure. Yes. So, no. Sure. 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 S
And then you get to that point where you say, you know, bad day, but if I wake up tomorrow morning and I want to be a 10, I'm going to be a 10. That confidence comes with age. That unfortunately doesn't um, come at 18. Definitely not at the time that I was 18. The 18 year olds today are far more evolved because they have social media, they have great awareness. We didn't have Google and we didn't have YouTube and we didn't, so our world was very different. But yes, in today's time, if you tell me to define the business of beauty and perfection, I'd tell you just walk all over it, darling. There's no such concept. The only thing that matters is how you perceive yourself. Do you like who you see in the mirror? And if you do, and good for you, don't listen to anybody else. Thank you so much. Any questions for any of the panelists? Or we'll just take one more last question. Anybody? No. Okay. No? OK. Thank you. Va? That was quick. Thank you. Thank you.